Welcome to another edition of Tasker 101 Tutorials, sponsored by HollywoodPhoto.com and AndyTags.com. This is Lesson 21B. Lesson 21B. Um, in Lesson 21, we created this really cool profile that if you received a text message and it had a word you specified in it, the word emergency, then it would trigger uh, this uh, uh, task that turned silent mode off raised all your volumes, and then played a ringtone. Now let's say you wanted to make this so that if you were asleep, um, it would continue playing until you woke up. There are a couple ways to do this. I'm going to uh, show you two ways you could do it. Um, one, I'm going to click the plus button. I'm going to click task. I'm going to click wait. I'm going to make that about 23 seconds. And then I'm going to add another task. Task, and then go to, and go to number, I think it was five. So in this case, it's going to do all the settings. It's going to play the ringtone. It's going to wait 23 seconds, and it's going to go back to play the ringtone again. The reason we're having it wait 23 seconds is because if you just put the go-to, um, when it starts playing that ringtone, it doesn't stop the uh, task list from executing. So it will go to the next task automatically. And if you just put go-to, then it'll just can be continually trying to play it. And uh, you don't want that to happen. So uh, this is one way to do it. And uh, I'm going to show you how this way would work. Go back to my home screen, send myself a message again with an uh, emergency in it. This time I'm just going to type the word emergency and click send. So the song is playing. It's going to play that entire song. And when it's done, it's going to go back and start playing it again. Okay, so that's the end. Now the wait is still processing the 23 seconds. And when it gets to the end of those 23 seconds, it's going to go back and start playing it again, as it did. Now how do you stop that? There's only one way to stop that in this case. We'd have to open Tasker. We have to go to that task. And then click that stop button. When you click that stop button, that cancel button, that stops it. But that is the only way. Now, um, just to let you know, I tried to figure out a better way to stop it with the ringtone and could not make it happen in any other way. Um, I tried putting a notification in the notification panel that had an action that when you tapped it, it stopped this from happening. Uh, that did not work. Um, I then tried doing the same thing with the scene, and that did not work. So I'm going to show you another way to do it, because you might want to do it with a scene, and this is how you would do that. We're going to get rid of the play ringtone, and the wait, and the go-to. We're going to click plus to add a new activity. We're going to go media. And this time we're going to have music play. And we're going to choose a file. This takes a little bit more because you actually have to browse through your file system. Um, which means I have to remember where in the world my uh, ringtones are on my file. Because I don't think they're in music. Nope. Okay, so there we are in alarms, and let's see, I can pick uh, any song I want to pick here that I think will really uh, wake me up. How about, let's go with a skillet song. Um, you can start it past the one second mark if you want. We want to start at the beginning, and then I'm going to click loop. 
and I'm going to have it stream through media. And there we go. So we're all set. Because I have loop, that means it'll just play over and over and over again. So then how will we stop it? Well, now we need to create a uh, scene to stop it. So we'll create a scene. And click the plus button. We're going to call it 101 E text stop. So stop emergency text. I'm not going to be too picky about this. Uh, we've done other lessons about scenes. It's going to be really fast. So we're going to long click and I'm going to choose text. I'm going to say stop music. And we'll say text size. See what 43 looks like. Text color. We'll make it really bright. And that should be that. And then uh, tap. And so this will be our tap action. Add an activity, media, and then music stop. So this will stop the music. We're going to have that right there. So there we go. Okay, it wants to be annoying. There we go. Okay, so that's that. So now we have that done. Now there is one more thing we need to do. We need to go back to task and go to loud text. And we need to make sure that it actually shows that. So, and then go plus. We're going to select scene. We're going to select show scene. And then click the little search button. And she's the one we just created, 101 E text stop. And we'll say show it as an overlay. Okay, and that gave us a good warning. What that said, let's just see it again. It's saying that uh, you can't have an exit button on that type of uh, display and so you have to have a built-in way to destroy it so I'm gonna change that from overlay to dialogue dialogue dim behind I think that will be a good way alright so now we can test this This time, I'm going to just put my phone into silent mode. And now we're going to send a text with the word emergency in it. Emergency and send. So when that text comes through, it should trigger, first it should turn silent mode off, which it did, and it triggers playing that song, and because it's a loop, it'll play that song continually until you hit stop music, but as soon as you hit stop music, that's gone, and you can get out of that by hitting the little X down here, or just simply by hitting the return button. So that's the way that you can uh, uh, make a quick way to stop it. Probably more practical if you want, um, want it to be right on top there. So you can stop it quickly. You know, if you're using this for, say, if you're in a movie or in a meeting or something and there's an emergency, as soon as you hear it, you want to be able to stop it and not have to go into task or to stop it. So that's why using the, uh, uh, using the play media instead of, play ringtone, I mean play media, yeah, play media, play a song instead of using uh, play ringtone, uh, music play instead of play ringtone is a better choice for uh, if you want to loop it because then you can just loop it and then you can just stop it with a, by creating a scene that stops it. 
All right, so that's it for this lesson. Hopefully you found that useful. Even if you're not gonna use this particular profile, you know, you always pick up little things here and there from different profiles that you can then put together to create your own profiles. It's completely different from anything I've shown you uh, just by the, the stuff you pick up here and there. So hopefully you found it useful. Uh, you can share this, please do, on Facebook and uh, Google Plus and Reddit and all those other ways. Um, Cause uh, the more people watch, the better, the more likely I'll be able to do more of these uh, right now. Cause I don't make any money doing this. I have to have a job, and that's why I haven't been any reviews in a while. Uh, but I'm certainly going to try to keep doing it uh, in my spare time when I can. So uh, please share it, uh, subscribe, check out my channel. I've got Android app reviews and product reviews and NFC reviews and all kinds of things over there you can check out. And check out HollywoodFrodo.com. It's my website, as well as AndyTags.com, which is a good place to get NFC tags for use with your Android phone. Anyway, that is it until next time. So have fun with Tasker. Mm -hmm.